with an exclusive story. The hunt is on for two men who punched and stabbed a tow truck driver during a case of road rage. And tonight, that driver is speaking only to WBZ. Good evening. I'm Paula Evans. And I'm Liam Martin. The driver tells us he regrets getting out of his truck on 495 and that he then got sucker punched. Mike LaCrosse is live tonight in Bolton with more on this story. Mike? Liam Paul, the tow truck driver was just trying to head back to New Hampshire after dropping off some cars at the auto auction in Framingham when he says he was cut off and attacked by those two men who remain on the loose tonight. So I'm on call, so. Donnie Hardy isn't letting a road rage stabbing prevent him from doing his job. He's still out of tonight as a tow truck driver in New Hampshire hours after getting attacked, getting off exit 27 on 495 in Bolton. A car came up the center lane, jumped right in front of my truck. Hardy swerved to avoid hitting the car, blew his horn, and yelled at the driver who cut him off. That's when he says the driver jumped out of the car. Against his better judgment, Hardy got out of his truck too. Then he started coming at me a little more, reached in his pocket, pulled out a box cutter. Hardy started to back up when he was attacked. He hit me a couple of times um, in the chest, on the side. He says the second guy snuck up on him from behind and sucker punched him in the head, knocking him to the ground. Uh, when I got back on my feet, they were both running to the vehicle uh, and had taken off at that point. Mass State Police say they're looking for two white men in connection to the road rage incident last seen around one today by Hardy driving a gold Chevy Cruze with a mass plate containing T8 or TB. Hardy only saw part of the plate because he had blood and sweat in his eyes. He's hoping someone who recognizes the guys can fill in the gaps. I'm hoping they don't do it to somebody else. I'm hoping that, you know, they get caught. Hardy says he always has a dash cam in his tow truck, but unfortunately today it did not have the memory card inside. That's why, again, he's hoping that anyone that was in the area of exit 27 on 495 today around 1 o'clock, if they saw something, to give Mass State Police a call. We're live in Bolton tonight. I'm Mike LaCrosse, WBZ News.